You know what makes wolves such good predators? They're smart. Rather than hunting strong, healthy prey, they go after the weak, the injured, the sick, the most vulnerable. Todd here happens to be the CISO, or Chief Information Security Officer of one of the medical world's biggest software companies, which means he's in charge of keeping all their data safe should the bad guys come knocking. At the moment, Todd is experiencing some chest pains. Maybe he ate some bad fish, huh? But I know what's really going on here. Tons of hospitals use Todd's company to host all their patient data in the cloud. Now, if I can remove him from the equation, no one here would have the authority to take the company offline and secure all that data during an attack. So last week, I paid his doctor a little visit. Carmella, the doctor will see you now. Good luck with that hip, Carmella. At offices like this, people are rarely at their desk for long. Of course, that wouldn't be a big deal if their smartphones could automatically lock down their PCs when they walked away. But right now, I'm hiding some malware that will allow me to bypass all their protections. <laughs> this old PC, they'll never be able to detect or remove it. This way, I could access Todd's file, and thus, all his prescriptions. Just like that, I was able to mess with the dosage of his blood pressure medication, the side effects of which are dizziness and really bad indigestion. And now, a trip to the hospital, just like I planned. Any family members you want to contact? My wife, but I don't want to worry her. I'm sure it's not. Oh, it's going to be something, all right. Commoners! Oh! Most people think hospitals are scary. They've got no idea. Hospitals just like this one might be home to some of the most advanced medical equipment on Earth. But, like most businesses, they're also crawling with unsecured printers like this guy. Without BIOS level protection to keep it safe, anyone can install just about anything on here. Now, that little software update just allowed me to create a backdoor directly into their network. I just changed his name in the system. Seriously, this thing is like a sieve. Take good care of it, John. John, his name's Todd. You can't even keep his name straight. Now, if someone, his wife, or say anyone from his security team back at the office calls looking for him in an emergency, no one's gonna be able to find him. <sighs> Sweet smell of success. Get comfortable, Todd. Things are about to get real interesting, thanks to that old printer. If it had threat detection, it would have stopped my attack before it started. But since it doesn't, there's nothing to stop me from using it to print out some results I made all by myself. Here are the revised labs, doctor. OK, thank you. Ah, uh, we are going to have to increase your medication. You're going to feel a little groggy, but it's OK. Talk about the gift that keeps on giving. Now he's going to sleep through the night. Guess we no longer have to worry about him answering that cell phone over there. You're probably wondering why I go through all this trouble. Well, I'll show you. Three, two, one. This is good. You're right about that. Am I the only one seeing this? Oh, no. Oh, yes. We need to call Todd. They take it upon themselves to cut off every hospital on their network, or hope and pray that Todd will miraculously appear to save the day. What am I looking at? Sir, it appears there's been a data breach. Yeah, I can see that. Where the hell is Todd? Uh, at the moment, we don't know where he is. You don't know? Someone is stealing all of our medical records from all of our hospitals, and you don't know where the hell Todd is? I love a good mystery. Don't you? I'm sorry, Dave. It's not personal. With their chief information security officer out of the picture, they're basically paralyzed. Even though they spent a ton making their network super secure, it turns out the PCs attached to it were not. Does this thing have hardened multi-factor authentication? Nope. Even the backup servers have been compromised. Hardware and force protection to stop these poor folks from exposing everyone every time they clicked on a bad link? Negative. 
without anything like that to stop me. My malware can devour every file it touches. Time to dial up the fun. I now have in my possession the health records of millions of patients. All because I hacked one doctor's office, one hospital, and made one guy disappear. Let's put Todd back on the grid, shall we? Oh, come on. You didn't really think I was just gonna leave him here, did you? Sir? Your wife is on the phone. Uh, yeah, Todd's okay. Hey, honey. Well, I can't say the same for his company. But for me, this is a whole lot bigger than them. This is about getting the world to see all the holes in the system so we can tear it down piece by piece. Weakness, my weakness. So we can rebuild it. And to those of you in the hallowed seats of power and government, know this, you're next. HP Business Printing, the world's most secure printers. HP Elite PCs, the world's most secure PCs.